Alright, so this is an, another tutorial for, well, this is actually the first, there's not another. Um, there were previous ones, but I did not post it, so let's just get to the point. Um, I'm gonna transfer the um, Blue Stocks SD card location in, in my um, PC. I mean, yeah. So I'm, I, I would like that to be somewhere visible like local disk D, like documents um, so that if ever I need to you know use the files that I downloaded from Bluestacks or the files that I obtained from Bluestacks I will be able to access it easily without going to the original location so firstly let's get into the original location of Bluestacks so as you can see, it's already included in this tutorial. So let's begin with the tutorial. Uh, the first step is to uh, locate the um, BlueStacks location, the SD card, the actual location before we move it to a different um, folder or different uh, partition. So first, you go to File, then Options. There you will see um, the settings, then go to view, and yeah, I already did it, but normally it would be like this. So go to show hidden files, folders, and drives, apply, then okay. So once it applies, you will see this uh, invisible folder, program data, and you click that, and enter. Uh, enter. You go there and go to blue stacks. Um, then I don't know, forgot, but yeah, it's blue stacks. Then engine. Yep. Then user data and shared folder. So there. Th this is the actual location. If you don't want to transfer or to move it to another location, that's fine. Although I would recommend you to do so. But it's fine. I mean, you don't have to take the risk because basically you will be going to the registry when you handle this and, you know, you don't want to mess things there. So if you want to play safe, um, you may you may or may not do it, right? So this is the location and you can just basically go to this location. So you can see there, program data, blue stocks, engine, user data, shared folder, and then... Um, you go there and just copy the files. The files will appear here. But if you want to uh, put it in an accessible or a more accessible place, then what you're gonna do is go to registry. <clears throat> so if you mess something here, I wouldn't take responsibility on that. It's up to you. I uh, just wanna remind you to be careful. Uh, when you know tinkering with the registry so there we go uh, first you go to H key yeah, at this one yep I can just pause the video and copy this location go here then let's find that and H key local machine there we go uh, software uh, blue stacks, so let's be uh, guests. Android shared folder. All right, there we go. So on this one, the shared folder. Okay, there's another one zero. So go to the zero. Right, click the path and then modify. New key. Right click then how to modify it. This one. Wait, let's see. Right click on path. Where's the path? Okay, per perhaps this one. Yep. This path. <clears throat> and click on modify or modify. So write the path of the folder which you want to include in SD card. Example. SD card. So, 
I'm gonna put the location here, I guess, in, um, let's say, documents. Okay. So, dear new folder and blue stacks. Uh, SD card. Yep. So, I have to label it SD card because I might forget. I, I might just think that it's just a system folder that has been created upon installing BlueStacks. So, I have to put SD card just to remind myself. Because normally, I would delete those uh, when I have to reformat a PC, which I do very often. So, write the path and then... <clears throat> okay, write the path. So, we change the path into the path that I created. So how to find it? So first go to the folder that you created, then just click on this. No, okay, that's fine. Go to properties. All right, D. Copy the location, and then paste it here. There we go. There. Restart your computer for the changes to take effect. You can find the folder. Root. You can uh, restart your computer. Okay, so we will have to restart the computer then. So save. How to save this one? Modify. Okay, I think that's already saved upon the changing it. Yeah? So okay, that's automatically saved. So actually, I'm very um, making sure everything. So um, yep. So that's it for now, and that's um, how you. Move the SD card location of BlueStacks to the location you desire. So that's it. Alright, that's it for now and uh, thank you for watching.